Let us consider two blocks that are connected by an ideal spring as shown in the diagram and are free to slide on a horizontal frictionless surface. The blocks are pulled apart so that the spring is stretched and then released from rest. Say we want to determine the ratio of the velocity of block one to that of block two, in other words, V1 over V2, as the separation of the blocks decreases. We take as our system the two blocks and the spring. After we have released the blocks, there is no net external force acting on the system. We can therefore apply the principle of conservation of momentum to the system. The initial momentum of the blocks before they were released is zero. Therefore, the final momentum is equal to m1 v1 plus m2 v2, which is equal to zero. Therefore, m1 v1 is just equal to minus m2 v2, and therefore the ratio of v1 over v2 is equal to minus m2 over m1. The minus sign indicates that the two velocities have opposite directions. Now let us look at the ratio of kinetic energies of the blocks as their separation decreases. K1 over K2 is just equal to a half M1 V1 squared over a half M2 V2 squared, which is equal to M1 over M2 times V1 over V2 all squared, which is equal to M1 over M2.